welcome back to the Wisconsin Greg Show. Uh, they're here to uh, harvest my corn today. They started at 9.30 this morning and they're moving right along. I'd say they're over two-thirds done. I had to hurry up and get out here before they're done. Hopefully I can get a little bit of video of them. Um, I haven't asked them if I can go up in the combine yet or not, but they usually let me go, so hopefully we can uh, go up in the combine and get a ride, but I'm gonna try to get a little bit of video of them out here, so. Let me turn this camera around here. For all my new uh, subscribers and viewers, um, I have a small farm, uh, but I have somebody else do the harvesting part of it for me. Um, I have uh, 40 acres of corn. It's not field. It's not sweet corn. It's field corn for cows and stuff like that. And I have 40 acres of soybeans. And they're doing the corn today, so I thought I'd come out here and get a little quick video. I was going to use another camera, so I'm using the GoPro today. Um, but uh, my other camera was full of videos, and I was getting them downloaded, and it was taking too long, so that's why I decided to use the GoPro. I had 16 videos on my other camera to get off of it. So I always let it go too long. I should do it like right after each video. It's a beautiful day here today for them to do their harvesting. They uh, ended up getting a new combine this year. I knew they, they got a new uh, grain head too. I'm not sure if the um, head for the corn is new or not. I'm guessing it is. So it's the same exact combine they had as last year, only just a newer one. Kind of curious how good the corn is this year. I know over by Elkhorn, about seven miles east of me, I heard it wasn't very good, but I don't know, we'll see. Oh. These guys do a lot of acres, they're busy. I'm usually towards the end of their route. They kind of go around in a circle, I believe, and uh, I think I'm like second to the last. So they're getting done. I can't remember how many acres they do, but it's somewhere between 1,000 and 2,000, I think. But they got all this over here all done already. Here's some of the corn. You can see it a little bit better. Kind of curious how it is. We've had a lot of wind. A lot of it, I think some of it got knocked down, but those uh, heads are pretty good at picking it up. So hopefully you don't lose too much from the wind. These guys are moving right along today. I think they're, uh, they want to get done. <laughs> I don't blame them because it won't be long, it'll be snowing here. But it's pretty nice today. We've had some bad weather, uh, a lot of wind and uh, some rain and stuff like that. But they got their, uh, they have two semis they use. Then they have a, a tool. Uh, I don't know what you call it, a uh, cart that they pull around with all their tools. Got everything on there that they need, like uh, welders and blow guns and their air compressors and everything. They got all kinds of stuff on there. So they fix it right out in the field if they have a breakdown. Most of the time. This is another area of the field. It's a little bit better. Stalks are taller, the ears are bigger. They have a monitor on there that tells roughly how many bushel per acre you're getting. I'm kind of curious. It's 
not always a hundred percent but it's usually pretty close in the area <laughs> 